hey what is up guys welcome back on the channel i hope you're all doing great and let's take a look at what benji has for us in the first day of the witch queen he's actually selling two new the witch queen weapons and they are really good in my opinion the first one is a fusion rifle it's called a snorri fr5 and this weapon might be very good for pvp if we take a look uh it's a new omelone uh weapon so it has the origin trait of omelone this trait does uh, increase reload speed and stability for the top half of the magazine so in that case the four first bullet will do uh, increase stability and also reload, reload speed so if you want to pair this with particle repeater it takes only three bullets uh, at least four bullets to activate this perk so we want to put this perk on so we have less bullets to activate this perk and we also want to pair this with extended barrel because it does increase range as you can see i bought it so if you put extended barrel you have 75 range and you can also master work it to have 85 range so we almost cap on range uh and you have also a lot of stability because you have firmly planted that increased stability and accuracy uh, when you are crouch and you have frenzy uh, this is a really good perk it increases damage when you are extending combat so when you pair all these perks together i think this weapon will shred in pvp in my opinion i will surely give it a try uh but that's it for this weapon and the other weapon that he's selling is the new redback 5 si this is a sidearm uh, if you like sidearm, this is a really good one for, uh, in my opinion, uh, PvE, not PvP. This will shred in low tier content PvE. I'm not talking about GMs here or high end content in the future of this season, but uh, this will be a great weapon for the campaign or for nightfalls, uh, not nightfalls, but regular strikes or gambit or anything like that, because uh the first perk is subsistent that uh reloads your magazine from reserve when you defeat targets and it has a rampage that increases damage for uh, every kills so when you have kills it increases damage that it can stack three times and when you get kills it also reloads a part of your magazine so you have almost infinite uh bullets with the uh, increased damage so that is very good pair uh, on each other and on top of that we have the uh, vast stinger origin threat uh, this threat does is damaging an enemy with this weapon has a small chance to reload the magazine and increase movement speed while aiming downside bows receive faster draw speed and the swords receive faster charge right while well, this perk is active so when you damage an enemy with this weapon it has a small chance to reload the magazine so you can reload the magazine with subsistent when you get a kills but you can also reload it with this perk uh when you just damage enemy so this is really good I, i'm sure you can have like you can shoot for 15 seconds 20 seconds without reloading this weapon uh, for sure and you can put the rampage mod on that increase the duration of uh, this perk that is very good uh in my opinion i will put flare magwell on this and uh i will put also uh maybe polygonal rifling i don't know uh, to increase stability because with this it decreased stability a little bit so that's what i would do if i were you but definitely buy this uh, i think it can be a lot of fun in pv so guys thank you for watching uh i hope you are enjoying the witch queen as much as i do if you like this video please drop a like uh, it will help me a lot and subscribe if you don't want to miss other videos like this i will post a lot of, of videos during the wish queen to help you guys with weapons weapons crafting mission uh, all the stuff related to destiny so i hope you enjoyed it and as always i'll see you in the next one guardians